Beautiful, that's all started. We return with urge. I did some grinding in my spare time, picked up a few bits. Sorry, I'm just sorting out my OBS. I know, how dare I? Alright. Epic. Hey, Zeke, how you doing? I'm pretty good, thanks. I just, uh, made an aid, a cake in a mug that I got for Christmas on my birthday or something. I think Christmas. Feel sick as fuck now. It's pretty cool. <laughs> how are you doing? Oh, no, I said the F word. YouTube's going to shout at me. Now I got to worry about getting demonetized because of all the random songs in games these days. And because I've got the mouth of a sailor. How would you even... What? How would you have 225 stars? Isn't the max 200? Now before we go anywhere, I need answers. And I need to take a minute to sort myself out. Imagine starting stream and not being ready to stream. What an absolute fool, eh? You bought something, dot, 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 and <laughs> seek. What you been buying, Zeke? Why, you got more than 200 stars, huh? Hmm... <laughs> Yeah, you dropped yourself in it now, haven't you, mister? Everyone, go harass Zeke. He's using Plants vs. Zombies hacks. <laughs> no, no! <laughs> Let me Oh, excuse me, crack my window open. Ah. You know. You almost chopped off your finger in one of your classes where you use power tools. What, what are you doing that for? It's a bit daft, isn't it? Alright, look at this. Look at all this fancy stuff we got lined up here. Actually. So, battery storage. We ready to go spelunk. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Fuck's sake, I just got gnomed. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you're damn right I just peed with my pants on, don't you? So we have this beautiful... Oh, actually, speaking of that, should get my plastic bag. So with the mighty plastic bag, you can pull the PP off the ceiling. Pretty cool. Let's 
right? You stand here. And you just individually collect all this weird stuff that grows. <laughs> What we do with any of this, I actually have no idea, but I'm sure we'll figure out something eventually. It's like scoop and poop. <laughs> Raft if it was always on land and never on water. Maybe, maybe. Could be right there. What is he getting? Is he getting stuck on there? And those just don't open all the way. Okay. Ah. Oh. Max stacks 32. No idea what we do with... Can be used as fertilizer? Curious. Combine it with coal. We can combine... Wait, we can go buy pitas with arrows? Okay, let's save and do some experimenting real quick. Right, P just combined with arrow equals P arrow. Cool. P just combined with coal equals fog spreading ammo. Mm, let's see, it's like an early game. Curious. Let's reload real quick, because I don't want that PR. <laughs> Damn, I should have done some more testing while I was there. Foolish! Kind of weird, we always spawn. Staring at the ceiling or the floor. But right, let's do some basic tests. Wire, metal, duct tape. Uh, I guess coal. Firewood, resin. Glue. All right, you can make pyjama. That's cute. All right, all right. So let's start combining some things. Stick and wood. Stick and glue, sorry. Plywood. Okay. Stick and rag. Crossbow. Okay. And we know stick and sheet metal gives us our axe. Uh, we can break down sheet metal into... That's duct tape, a rag and duct tape. Tape armor. External damage. Cute. Uh, rag and wood we just did. Okay. Duct tape. Gunpowder and resin. Curious. What? Oh, we probably just made glue. Fucking idiot. <laughs> oh, 
All right, that makes the armor, yeah? What can we combine the bone with? That's actually curious. We can duck get bone. Oh, my days. <laughs> I'm gonna check out how the bone ship do. Okay, you're not allowed to eat it, just, just double check it to be safe. <laughs> Alright, the rest of that's pretty simple. Um, Can we combine that with anything? No. But that is for crafting. Okay, well we did a bunch of combining, we didn't really get anything useful out of what we can combine together so far, except from a duct tape is... Maybe, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about the bone ship. Kinda like our first sword. But honestly, I... <laughs> Is doing barely any extra damage. Alright, one last load. <clears throat> now that we've figured out what we can stick with what, how do we play the game? Okay, so... From what bit of... Well... Sorry, I had to mute so I could move the mic over. I'm just, uh... Gotta bring this one in close and personal. Get the old brain going. I think you wrote a proper explanation here. Through scraps we've found laying around, we've figured out that we are some sort of unique individual who has a bladder... difference. <laughs> we'll say anomalous properties of the bladder. Through unknown means, we somehow produce a very strange... Uh, substance, this thing, Urid. It's like Urid dust, and it goes up into the sky and makes the sky all yellow and stuff, and the yellower the sky is, the more enemies they are, the worse they are. I think I'll keep the broken bottle. I prefer that. We definitely should cook some food to bring with us. Oh, did all our food go sour? Because of the saving and the loading. Right, right, I remember now. Uh, this whole Ura dust, we should put it in a different box. Empty a box. I like this box. Beautiful. Damn, you know before we go anywhere, we should put the batteries away and do one last... Little run. Yes, yes indeed. Oh wow. Wow, that's a lot of work for a piece of saltpeter, holy crap. But we did it, we got one whole saltpeter. Filling it up with pee is no problem. We can get that done in no time. I wonder what you can put in the compost. Could we put urid in the compost? I'm curious. We're learning. It's... Oh! I have a weak constitution. I was not ready. Uh...
No. Rip. What can you put in there then? Can I just throw meat in it? Yes. That's good to know. Um... Alright then, well I guess we'll be back to figure out what else we can throw in that thing. Uh, piece stuff in there. Actual gunpowder. Hmm. These guys will be great for making salty of them because... You get all sorts of them. Technically, I guess any combat would be good for saltpeter. Look at all these bugs. Come fight me. You should turn the audios up. What, for the game? Well, you got to understand. You see that? You see how when I stab something, it's just as loud, if not louder than me? The audios is up. You can barely hear the soft steps of his feet. In Bush? Where's Bush? It's called Russell Bush, so you can hear that. The audio is just weird in the game. You hear that? You can go anywhere from halfway up to nearly my volume with a little up volume. And then when you stub something, <laughs> it's just loud. <laughs> hey, let's have a look at the audio settings. This is our settings so far. Uh, volume, volume music. If I turn the volume up any more, it will be deaf. If I turn the volume up, it turns the volume up of other things that aren't related to volume. So music effects are actually related to... a bunch. Well, actually has under it a bunch of different... Uh, back here. Sound listings, like maybe door volumes. Maybe footsteps or something, I don't quite remember. But I remember when I changed it, a bunch of other audios that weren't music got a lot louder. Because I turned it up to see, um, well, if I just had it too low and there was actually music. And there is music, it just kicks in very rarely and scares the crap out of you because you think something bad's about to happen, but you're most likely just alone. <laughs> Now, I'm not going to lie, so after I, we got into this game straight away, I went down the first manhole I found I could destroy, which is right behind the first house after the tutorial. This was, well, a bit of a nightmare, as it turned out. I ended up in some cave systems, I had two batteries to my name, and that those batteries lasted me a long time down there. I farmed those batteries so we can go big adventure and go through all the different cave systems I know about nearby, into the tunnels and that, uh, to try and find saltpeter. But also to maybe find some more lore and stuff. Uh, that's why I've been farming in my spare time. But that was a big downside for us because there's a lot of world up top. So, once we finally got out of there, I stumbled across this little crappy place. Stuck down some bits and between streams I decided, you know, this game. It's a fun little goofy game. Main point of my waffle is when we got out of those tunnels initially. We'd been peeing. The game says don't piss on the ground. And we didn't take it seriously. Okay. <laughs> when we got out here, there's like giant elongated worm people. There's the machine gun nuns. Um, some horrific aerial creatures. I, I can't quite remember. Uh, there was a lot of horrific monsters here and there as well. Uh... We've learned since then, so I always carry molotovs because the pee, you can burn the pee. And that's good to know. Actually, we should keep those on us before we do all crafting and leave. Oh, eight meat. Nice. Very nice. Oh, we wanted the coal. I'm gonna store coal and salt pee right here to make the gunpowder. We got super lucky and found fuel as well. Holy crap, we found gunpowder and fuel and it was 
the happiest day of my life. Uh, this one's gonna go with number three. Spoiled flesh. High five. How full are we right now? We got some meatsies on us, but other than the meatsies, duct tape put away. And we're good to go pretty much. Awesome. So yeah, you make these top areas because they stuff this urid pea dust stuff that goes up. And when the pea dust goes up, it's bad for us. It makes all the monsters more and stuff, I guess. <laughs> Before we go into the caves, I think we're going to have to go hunting real quick. And cook us some food. And that's the other thing. Hunting means anything in this game. Anything is game. Any enemy that gets a squishy sound, you can keep hitting it till it gives you meat. And that is just what I intend to do. Although we might have to go to sleep soon. So, every single day, loot seems to have a chance of respawning. Oh, well, it does respawn. Just a chance of um, being in places. So you just come back from these places and check them. It's simple. Oh, yeah. I don't even think uh, I was on stream. Maybe, maybe not. But I made a broken bottle with duct tape and alcohol. Good to know. Ah, you see, this fella... These fellas been harassing us a lot. These chainsaw little buggers. Mm -mm. Intimidating pains in the bum. They just stalk you. Fox spreading rifle rounds. Nah, I'm good. Be bear. Actually, we should. We should stock up on everything. Don't matter what it is. So, for this stinker, right? I'm gonna get you Molotov. Are you not hostile? Okay. Hi. Yeah, he is hostile towards us, okay. Are you gonna try and poke us? What would you want? <laughs> well, now you want to kill me. I'd love if there was a way to interpret what the hell they were going on about. Why are you so aggressive, man? We could be friends. I wonder what happens if we shoot them in the face. Hey, you like that? I'll do it again. Okay, we don't have time for this. So, you throw fire at them. Damn. Damn. Two times we missed. There we go. And you poke the crap out of him. <laughs> and then to collect their meat, you hack the crap out of them. Turn up the dun dun dun, bro. Uh, my heart couldn't take it. Oh, look, there's the meat. <laughs> and then you do the other arm. Oh, 
Don't say more fog causes more enemies. Stinky. <laughs> and we've come back to the bottle. Hmm. Curious. Salvation is at hand. We've done it. There's the pea house, guys. We're saved. Just his whole idea was just powering back up. <laughs> Interesting. There's a couple of things I am slightly interested in grabbing before we go. Although at this point, we may as well chop a couple of trees and have a big fire. Chess. Different chess. Or food. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. Let's get some wood. Oh, actually, yeah, we should stop piddling. Whoopsies. Excellent. You see how the sky's got that yellowy tint to it now? That's the pea dust going into the sky. This pea dust right here. This is your chance to burn it before it goes up. And it will go up, all the way up. One thing that happened off stream is a geyser erupted. And I had to go find it by its horribly loud rumbling audio. Eventually, after like a few minutes of running all the way back to where we came out of the floor initially, I found the geyser. It was that weird pokey thing, you know, just sticking out the front of it. I now know what that looks like, so that's high five. But never really figured out how to close it. It just kind of occurred until it stopped. And in the end, I ended up getting some wood and just sticking a wooden beam in the top of it. But I don't know whether that's actually going to class as blocking it or not. So if it happens again, then we'll have a clue. Ah. 
They should be choppable. So all the decently straight round trees can be chopped, I'm pretty sure. I did forget to do. I'll just try and grab my extra wound. Don't say more fog causes more enemies. I guess some of that fog finally floated up to the atmosphere. There is a fog meter you can build to actually determine. We've got a pretty empty inventory. We should go back to that car. And these little blowers. If you step on that, or break that, should I say. Uh, it will release Malfaug. There's that car. Should have the bottle on the boot, hopefully, if it didn't despawn or respawn or something else. Oh, no, let's go. So it's like a plastic bottle, a pipe, and a few of them. We can check it right now. It is. That's a collector. We could probably spare that. That's what I've been trying to save up for. Two duct tape, a wire, a glue bar, and a plywood. There we go. Two duct tape, a wire, a bar, and a plywood. Glue bar. Silly. I'm confused. Which way is it meant to go? Spike. Oh, I guess the spike's meant to stick in there. I have no idea how this works, but we'll just whack it down. Oh, right. So over time, <clears throat> excuse me, I guess while we slept, the amount... Oh, sorry, no, because when we woke up, it was yellow. So just in the day alone that we've been here, completely dissipated. So it does dissipate at a relatively fast rate, but I'm pretty sure you pee faster and you looting things will also... Often release dust. Extra wood, awesome. Let's get fire going. How much meat do we have? Two meats, and we can throw the rest in the compost. Can I? There we go.
Ah. Fire hurts. Very nice, that's big for us. Oh, we've got plenty of food. Awesome. Nice. Right, we will not need anywhere near all this food, so we can stick that back. Gonna have plenty of coal, that's nice. Second powder. Gonna have boom. Hmm. 
Let's have a gun. I need a battery life. Got food, so we're good. find alcohol along the way I'd imagine and I don't think we need anything else for now <coughs> damn it I've got the hiccups oh. yeah I reckon that thing will do some damage all right Oh, we should drink our healthy leeks here. Can we combine that with anything ever? I wonder. There we go. Full health. How about we start local? There is, on this path, there it is. Always check your surroundings, kids. Remember that. Hey, where do you think you're going? We're gonna get plenty of meat from this. Works for me. Juicy. My meat boy. Getting all the meat and bones. I don't know what bones are really good for though, other than infinite bone shivs. Okay, we're gonna proceed. How much meat we get from that? We got a full stack of meat, nice.
Oh, all right. Now we know where it comes out. Time to go in deep. Oh yeah, then the enemies turn into that. And she can break it and get an extra bone. What all these bones are for, I couldn't tell you. There's these weird blobs as well. They expand. It's concerning. Let's have a look. There we go. I feel a lot safer now. From my shank, though. Gotta say, <coughs> excuse me, I don't know whether it is about this game, but it certainly gets you heart beating, which is very peculiar because it's quite a simple game. Hmm, let's check out left first, why not? in this direction now. Oh, by the way, this isn't actually walking. This is running. That's our stats. Our oh, fat's dropped plenty. I haven't really been eating, I guess. But that's good. We want to be under, like, the minimum fat so we're fast. So what do they say about fat? It slows you down, but reduces energy... But... Reduces energy reduction from activities. Ooh! Oh! No! 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 I hated that. <laughs> I fucking hated every bit of that. We're going to make a fire. And we are going to cook you right here. Right now.
Well, this is a big meat stop. And a nice one of that. She ah, we peed on the fire. Yeah, our pee is super flammable. And yep, that's what happens. There you go. Well, we'll go see what's at the end of the tunnel first, because that's what we were doing. Lucky for us. I'm just going to pause the game. <clears throat> when a grenade comes rolling up to my feet, I get very suspicious. So I uh, give me two secs to sort out what I'm doing. So I can give this my full attention. I say that. Who the people coming? Please outside. Da -da -da -da. Oh, that wasn't the way. We would have tunnel to rock. Okay, I just so happen to also know where this is. This is where we found one of our pieces of paper. There's this dude. There's a spawn herbal liquid. Ooh, oh, indeed. Dr. Tappe, we don't need you. Possum. Pepper. Yeah, I also saw this crash plane. We'll quickly go check that since the uh, rocks have taken us out here. Then we'll come back to this pile and go inside. By then, the nuclear fire should have stopped burning. <laughs> And we do have clarification. The Rajas vehicles dotted around everywhere. Well, oh, by everywhere, I should say scarcely, but I'm sure we'll find one at some point. For now, though. Hello, hello, hello. What have we here? Oh, it's just a bunch of boxes. Well, I shouldn't say just a bunch of boxes. That's a bunch of potential spawns. Whee! Oh, it's a derp deer. It's fine. You scared me, derp deer. While we're here. What the hell? More stank liquid. What? Hmm. I got too many batteries. We just fall through. The oh no, there it is. Oh. 
Well, the new one is out. Can you recharge it? Okay. What is making that noise? Jesus, is that the possum? I think that's the possum, right? Why are you so noisy? What's up with you? Okay. <laughs> you were. Possum do what possum do. Who was fitting in this plane? Freaking Dias, ah. Oh. Oh, scrapyards though for metal spawns. Big. Big, big. We've got another scrapyard out near our old house too. Oh, I say our old house. Where we got pooped out of the sewer systems and took a five minute refuge. <laughs> what does pink engine go for? I thought that you were a resource. You look so pretty. What are you doing? You want some? That's what I thought. Hop, hop, out of here. Oh, wait, no, we didn't check the building, did we? Super important. Gotta check the little cabins and stuff when you're at a new place. Why? Because you might find a piece of paper that tells you why the hell you're here. Duct tape? Oh, we dropped it, didn't we? We shouldn't have, actually. Duct tape's very important. Um... Hmm... I can't see a reason to keep bones around for now. Well, we can throw bones on an open fire. Okay. Hey! hey what? Excuse you? It was alive. Oh, yep, we fired it, and there's the peak cloud. So that mean every time we fire, we gun, we make a flammable peak cloud. I don't see that that's a terrible downside, really. Oh no! Oh, we cannot pick the meat. Hell, if we get the saltpeter at this rate, we ain't gonna be able to do anything with it because we ain't got no bloody inventory space. Hopefully that meat rots. That's pretty much what we're hoping for at the moment. We don't want to leave our miracle licks behind. It's kind of important. And the grenade's also pretty dear to my heart as it can turn into ammunition. But also meat is dear to my heart, because it can turn into ammunition. Hmm. Bugs are great. For the meat and for the spoiled flesh.
Oh my dears, I'm a fool. Organic waste, right? We could throw organic waste into them. We could be murdering bushes. What's all this then? Metal sheets, oh my god. Slurp. Slurp, slurp. What's this then? Oh, okay. It's not actually there. Search everything, isn't it? Because you never know what you might find, and there's always going to be a, a possum harassing you and following you around. It's also the other list. Hey. Trying to take that place in. Called Dara. Looks like we got reflections, so yeah, we got a lake going on. And a yellowish house. Oh, he's making a noise. <gasps> Shook the miracle juice, doesn't matter. Get the shovel. Oh my god. Bugrush, bugrush, bugrush. Well, something came out of his head and ate his hand. And we'll never know what it was. We can dig with sure. Oh, hi. Okay, we can get soil. That's big.
this fire barrel, that's the one. And soil to grow your own stuff. Okay, well, uh, sad story found under there, but... Oh. Got a shovel. Alright, well, we'll quick walk home, and then... Back off on our mighty adventures. Birds having a rough day. I got so excited for a second, I thought that was going to be like, um... Hujimaju. Oh, brain, why you lose words on me? That was going to be a back of a truck that would be like customizable motorhome. Oh boy, how wrong I was, eh? Actually. Where that ladder was doesn't make any sense because there was just a gap. <laughs> we won't think about it. Oh, blob! Oh. The blob sucks. Quite literally. You just get stuck in it, slow down, and it just slowly dissolves you. Fun. I guess all those bones are good because if you combine them with wire, you'll get I'm all right. But I haven't exactly seen anything that's going to give us a lot of wire so far. And it doesn't happen all that much, surprisingly, that you've come across wire. I mean, during this whole stream, we've probably seen five pieces. But at the same time, once we're done making stuff out of wire, I guess we don't need it anymore. Resin, ooh. We have 20 metal sheets yet. We do. Ooh, 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 big. That's caps lock. Um, seven glue, a tap, and a seven pipe. I don't think we have seven pipes. We don't have seven pipe. Well, we'll forget about that dream for now then. Um, destroying the ecosystem. Pop you away. I'm so pretty happy, honestly. I didn't expect us <clears throat> to be doing so well. Super successful. Sorted brilliantly. So, have we got a huge pea stain in the sky? Is that why we're so yellow? Hold the phone. The put our detector upside down. Don't have a clue. I 
No, it's definitely getting... There's no way we woke up too soon to go to sleep. It's getting dark, man. No. Juicy sticks. Mm. Well, there is that facility behind us. I suppose we can go check the facility out. Well, it's not dark enough, apparently. just started raining the big time. What's all that then? Oh, that's another crashed board. We haven't been over there yet though. Now, don't tell me this is just a house. I thought this was like a bunker or something. Getting closer, having seen the other houses, I'm not realizing. Yep. <laughs> just a stinky old house. to sleep here though. Oh, we peed the floor, no. We empty now, so I should be able to call this organic waste. The berry. Everybody know the berry. What you doing? No fly zone.
Awesome. We did the thing. Okay, now I know how to reasonably farm that in my spare time. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm curious. But I will answer that in my own time. Ah, my brain. Rosin. And that's that. <clears throat> Back to the caves with us. Yay! <laughs>
my god. I'm sorry, try. <laughs> I said, oh, blah, blah, blah. "Tongue tied yet again." I'm sorry, guys. We tried communication unsuccessfully. Are we just stuck it up more. More meat. Oh boy, meat. <laughs> She was by the mankles. What the hell it was riding us. <laughs> Making the shank fast, real fast. Poke, poke. Okay. Are you saltpeter? Found the land of salt, Peter. This is just a rock, though, right? Yeah, such. That's a salt, Peter thing. Well, can we get up there? You won't stop me from getting my gunpowder, goddammit. 
Spam that space bar. You know you love to hear it. Beautiful. Oh. Well, my right forearm hurts now. Feel the burn. <laughs> My life. This dramatic music. This dramatic music just kicks in out of nowhere, making you think, what the f... And it stops. It's like nothing ever happened. Now, did a shadow salt Peter fall down? Yes. I was hoping we didn't get absolutely ripped off. Epic. Well, any more up there? Because I'll happily climb. No, sadly not. Although that alone has given us plenty of bullets. So, good news for us. It's just duct tape. Glue and duct tape. Glue and duct tape? No, glue and cloth make duct tape. Duct tape and gunpowder. Create shotgun shells for some reason. And we can make glue with charcoal and resin. And we find a lot of cloth. Although who knows, maybe we can even make that sometime. Oh, Jesus. Okay, back outside again. What? What type of cruel joke is this? Were we actually just never meant to be in this cave? Yeah, we either missed something big time or we just never were meant to be up in here. Maybe this is meant to be like a safe location for an awesome cave house. That is a pretty sick looking cave house. Stick everything you need in here. Stick a few lights. 
We're allowed to build in here now, right? Yeah. Stick one of them bad boys down. No shot. We were here. <laughs> we were here. I'm sorry, Sheep Metal Axe. I am betraying you. We just got some sane upgrades. So today we found a shovel. We got this freaking axe. We found saltpeter, or at least a reliable source. I'd imagine every day when we sleep, this place will respawn. We don't really get attacked by enemies down in here, too, either. Mm. There's a lot of bushes. I mean... This do look like a very sustainable place. I mean, there's not much food going around, that's a given, but... You can compensate for that. You can make a farm here. Alright, let's continue our merry adventures where we were. This is the cave we were in. We got caught with our pants down. All sorts of ungodly things started showing up. This time we got an axe. And a gun. And a lot of batteries. <laughs> like to see them keep us down now. And spoiled meat suddenly is nowhere near as important because I can just throw organic matter into the composter, which is amazing. Now that's, that's beautiful. Oh, this is also beautiful. How do I not die? The more you know. The whole barrel shotgun. I don't... I mean, I just don't trust it because it holds one less shell than this one, you know? Given they do the same damage, I don't... Oh. <gasps> and this rock... This is it, this is the rock. We've done it. We have cracked the Da Vinci Code. We are no longer poor men. Plastic bottle. Well, we peed in the bottle.
I don't even know if we need that anymore. Honestly, because we were using it as a weapon, but this does more damage. We moved up so far in the world. We freed up slots. Epic. Actually, one and three works pretty good. I don't quite remember which way we went. Yeah, I don't know about the whole coal thing, but I like the saltpeter down here. Coal's kind of pointless because there's trees. You can get a lot of trees and a lot of wood. This is definitely the way we came when we did this last time.
Hey. You tired or something? Trying to say you're hungry? Food. Well, that was the story of the strange caveman. Oh, awesome. High box. Huh. I know we couldn't go through there before. Because we had no flashlight. Also, huh? So can we just, you know what, let's do some experimenting. I have no idea what's making that noise, but if it doesn't stop, it's going to die.
Of course. I don't think it is blocking hits. Like, our forearm is blocking hits, but okay. Oh, we've stuck these on the fire. How long will it take for them to cook? Hmm. Oh, there we go. Glue bar. <laughs> and that combined with a piece of cloth is duct tape. The coal and the saltpeter in our inventory makes uh, gunpowder. Boom. You don't even really need to use people, bullets. I just made them because I could. There we go. Back in two sex folks. Big waffles and returns, hello. We've got an axe, we've got a sledgehammer. They do the same damage. Huh. Does that actually do damage to stuff? Yes, yes it does. Super attack. Oh my god, that better do a lot of damage to stuff. It takes a chunk of my stamina, man. Oh wait, we had a fire going, what am I doing? What the heck? Okay. There's our super fuel pee in action, guys. <laughs> oh, I love it. This game. Ain't it quite something?
Come on, I just want to heavy you. Come back. Fight me, your card. Probably just better for mine. Yeah, we'll go with that. Feel bad. Ah, that goes a direction, and we got over here at the left. Holy Lord, <clears throat> this actually goes somewhere. They were running away from me. Well, I mean, of course, the first one was. We shot them in the face and they learned a lesson the hard way, but the guy with the chainsaw backed up away from us. Curious. Giant pea puddle, cool. Hey, don't go following me now. Swim in the pea puddle? I guess we could. Little shit. Don't fight me, kid. <coughs> I 
That's right, boy. Correct. For some reason, I started picking meat up again. So okay, I guess we're picking up meat up. <sighs> Oh, was there actually anything down here, or was you just in a pain in the ace? Again. I refuse to be bested by a stinky piranha. Hi. Shh. Shh. Ah. Get the hell out of here. What the hell was all this? Oh my god, really? You only have one leg, how does that even work? Oh my Jesus. I was hoping we could get kiting or something from chopping the crap out of those guys. Would be pretty cool. We fat now because we've been eating a bunch of meat. <gasps> Not really. Oh, cool. Urge this thing real slow.
don't you do it. Just mind your own business or I'm going to have to shoot you. That's right, you're next, boy. No, you get out of here. yourself. One of these days I'll get that chainsaw. So what the hell are you, a zombie? I'm really confused. We get meat from them, we get spoiled flesh from them. I have no idea where I am right now, that's why I'm just hanging about here, so I don't just wander off and get lost. Could just try and wait for daytime, but well, that could be a while. Just do it. I don't care. Just sleep. I don't. Oh, what the hell is this? Okay, um...
we are just peeing forever. Didn't realize peeing forever was allowed. Okay. Well, we just peed a lot of fire. Um. Oh. Oh. Salt peter. I don't understand why we can pee forever, but that's pretty cool. We pee fire forever, guys. Random <laughs> and a corpse in the middle of nowhere. Ah. Oh, wacky wasteland. What else do you have for us? Oh, hey. give you meat? What, what do I do with you? You okay? I don't understand what he wants. He hasn't stabbed me, so I'll leave him alone. Good day, sir. Why is loudness a bad thing? I'm curious. I don't think we need all this extra meat. You take the protein bar. Fuck, we drank the alcohol. I did a goofy. Big bad goofy. Don't drink the alcohol, it makes you need to pee. <laughs> and Molotovs are great because when you do need to pee, they help you burn away the pee. Does this water hurt us? Oh.
the heck are you? A rock. We've got like the permanent <coughs> bush thing around our screen. Let's see if we can. Nope, we're stuck with it for now. Oh well. All I can say right now is we are a mighty, mighty way from home. I guess, yeah. What we can do is just follow that wall along because we know we can open. Oh, isn't this place the bloody headache? What a map, honestly. Early access game, folks. I wonder if we can get resin from these trees by just shanking them a bunch. No. <laughs> oh. Maybe we can plant the mushroom. That'd be pretty cool. Jesus, you allowed little fella. <sighs> My God, something. <laughs> Yowzers, I do not know whether it's because we drank the alcohol or what, but we need to wee real bad.
So we have a structure, we can go ahead to that after as well. I like it, I like it. The mist must be stronger here. That must be what's happening. Because our urge to pee is going up. We get thick bushes all the way around. Hmm. Yeah, I think we got it all. Feels kind of odd to be actually back on a road. You know, if we could find a town or something, that might be our best bet for finding um, a cow. Brum, brum. As far as the peace scale goes, it ain't so bad. As far as places go, that ain't so bad. Decent little hideout, that gas station. Comes with a free pee meter. Take make shotgun shells. I mean, first we need to. Uh... Okay, I guess this is going to be a temporary hill. Huh? 
And just for those curious, a temporary home is essentially getting a couple of things for storage. Excellent. I'd call that bliss hours. A box. That's pretty much all you need is a box. <laughs> oh heck, another place there. First I want to climb this tower, see where the where we are. That's one big old shipwreck. Oh, damn. Oh, could be of houses. And a chance for a car. Man, we aiming high now. We've moved up in the world. Fog spreading pistol rounds. I mean, them shotgun shells can did a number on the fog level. Given I know how to farm saltpeter and stuff now, I think we'll probably just go clean. Only downside is I'm pretty sure it's like metal scraps, like a metal sheet for pistol bullets. But to compensate, you do get like 12 or something. So that's pretty nice. We should be growing duct tape. Hitboxes. <laughs> wow. Can't believe we were just assaulted while relieving ourselves. Unbelievable, Jeff. Finally play that cassette we got at like the start of the game. That doesn't help much. A tree, a chair, camper van's there. See this is that that was about our platters. Metal sheet wood to make our axe. Don't let the fog rise. Correct. No sight. <laughs> he 
shot something. Huh. Okay. <sighs> That's the place we are. Urine used as biofuel. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know. Our PP burn real good. But Best Buy here. Wherever Best Buy here is. Are you kidding me? There's no way I have an ad. For something. That moved. I would just... No. Don't do this to me. What the fuck is this floating bullshit? Fuck. Is the door accessible? That tree stump scared the crap out of me, I'm not going to lie. Hello. Wait, this doesn't go up? What do you mean this doesn't go up? Why is everything in this place just plastic bar? Ooh, metal sheets, metal sheets. There's a glue and a stick make. Plywood. Oh my god, how many times am I going to forget that? That's it, there's no way up. Okay. Cranky. I guess that would be the way up. However that works. Well, so much about my hopes for a car. I can always dream. is important. Ah, screws it. We'll throw away the piece of meat.
Wow. I'm glad that deer found those spikes before I did. That <laughs> good to know they are effective. One of these days, damn it. Oh, Blob. Why? No one likes you, Blob. Oh, we max on the battery is all fine. Look at this fancy life. You can't burn the bob blob either. Can you pee on it? Wonder if this will do anything to the blob. Hear the sizzling, but I don't know if it's actually doing anything. Ooh. Big stretch. Oh yeah, we found that log as well we had to put away in a hurry. Herbal fluid. Oh, <coughs> Need dandelion nettles and alcohol. Okay. Whenever this is done burning off. Nope, the blob is still there. Okay. Oh, dude, no. oh my god, it expanded out. Okay. <laughs> yeah, so the way you damage the blob, it seems to just get bigger. So I really don't know what to do about those blobs that just show up. <gasps> this might be the place. This might be the one. It's a shame that truck is looking nasty. <laughs>
Don't trip and get cloth off beds. It would be a bit easy if we could. But we see so many of them about, it's worth a try. I guess not. And that's what this place has to offer, really. That was hugely disappointing. That was the hardware store and we got nothing. Nothing. I mean, actually, we got disappointment. There's that. <laughs> These are very conveniently aligned. Please tell me there is some sort of inside pacor. Hardcore pacor. What do you mean, invisible wall? Where? Now I feel double, triple, quadruple ripped off. <gasps> okay, I feel a little bit better that my ankles didn't break now. Look at that. Suddenly I'm full of appreciation. <laughs> <gasps> oh, because the yellow in these, I thought for a second they might have been uh, dandelions. Wait, dandelions? No, they're the fluffy ones. I think I'm thinking burdock. Maybe. Ground systems. Jeez, I don't know if I'm brave enough. <laughs> it just goes on out there. We just, we just witnessed the birth of sap. Huh. The more you know. Back into the sewer adventures, yay!
What? <gasps> Under the map, Hog. Well, let's go under the map then. Fine. How did you get down here, man? <laughs> Unbelievable. This is what we get for living life on the edge, chat. Hey, we actually found our original hole. Would you believe it? Crazy. <laughs> well, if ain't this a sad sight. I'm going to get my full stamina back. to try and get out of this. Because that was just a horrible idea. Oh god. Couple of spots here we jumped. Get us up. Bring us back. Oh, we were holding shift. Well, now we're dead. Oh, we're out of the map. I guess we're out of the map. Well, didn't this just break everything? Wouldn't it be nice if the developer thought of this and, I don't know, put up, like, a ladder on the outside of the map so I could <laughs> climb back up on in? Oh. oh, that works. Aha! Persevere and prosper. Toss some shit out of that. <laughs> Sky's looking kind of yellow. Curious what all that's about. Oh, 
Oh, I got pushed in. Okay. Oh. What? Things got up out of the swamp. It'd be better if you guys went back into the swamp. It'd be better for everybody. Hey there, a hole. We have wandered like an hour's worth of walking away from home. Oh my god, is that what I think it is? Yeah, that's right. They're dead now. Forever. To get a hoverboard, jet ski, hoverboard, both. What are you doing? <laughs> Leave me alone. Crouch jump.
this game definitely <laughs> has some strange vibes to it. Pretty cool game though. I'd like to see it. I mean, it's been developed over two years already. I'd love for the developer to be able to wrap things up nicely with funding from its early access and then move on to creating something even more wonderful. They've got the potential, they've got the ideas, they've got everything down here. Take themselves a well-earned break and then get back to taking the market. I mean, imagine if this thing was multiplayer. Just that simple addition would change so much. Why is our meat not cooking? Well, I guess that's what we're getting. We are deep into the middle of nowhere. No idea where we are. We would come out at night time, wouldn't we? The fuck is all this?
rip us. We came all this way just for it to be pitch black when we showed up. Yeah, we could just sit here. <laughs> it's fine. Nah, we don't need a flashlight, we'll be alright. That's creepy as hell. Every time I turn off my flashlight, it sounds like there's a uh, gravel. That's a curious one. Do we not have a moon? Did they blow the moon up? Oh my god. It's got to be getting lighter because I can actually see now. Yeah, the birds are coming out. Oh my god, guys, we did it. Oh, wait a second. Did he just have it so our eyes have adjusted to the darkness in the game? As possible. Which is pretty cool. If that is the case. But bad news for us, which means... It means the night's not over. Hmm. Oh no, it's definitely becoming daytime.
Well, this has got several sheds of bad real quick. It's got to be decent. I mean, it poked the bird pretty good. Ah, it's charge attacks fast. Wait, what? Well, we just slept into the middle of the day. And now we need to pee. Great. Extremely flower rupee. That's me. Ain't that just the darndest thing? back. And now I'm really curious why this science is danger. I guess we got real lucky and missed the danger. Well, that is going to be it for now. I'm probably going to waddle my ass back home and do some grinding. Uh, thank you all for watching that stream. Hope you have yourselves a lovely day. I'll see you next time and take care.